Pop Me Cake crew. It's wash day part two. So today, obviously, I'm going to be washing my hair. I took my weave out. Duh. Oh, my hair is so itchy, y'all. Sorry, but it's really itchy and I'm ready to wash it. I took a couple pictures last night after I took my weave out because, you know, every girl does that. You know, every girl does that. That's a must. What the f- See, look, absolutely not. Mm -mm. I got dead hair everywhere. I got hair just floating around. I got hair I don't want and I got hair I do want. Like, so we gotta wash it because this junk look crazy. Do y'all see this? <laughs> I don't know how black it looks, but I'm assuming it looks crazy. And plus, I was laying down on it, so. I gotta take these braids out because I only put them in my hair because I was gonna take pictures last night with all of my hair out and. I only took like only a couple and I wind up not taking these braids off. But that doesn't matter right now because who cares? We got to get straight to the shower because I need to freaking wash my hair. Let's get to the bathroom. Let's go. Uh. Well, you guys smell like doodle and corn chips. So um, I'm definitely going to spray this bathroom. Oh. Somebody, oh he needs no. some milk. How do you do that? Oh God, I would have bust my. Spray some Lysol, it's a good kind of disinfectant spray. I'm telling you guys, it's the best one out here. Cause somebody took a boo boo and forgot. But it's okay, it kills over a hundred germs, you'll be okay. But yeah, I'll be back cause I gotta use the restroom. Two hours later. All right, so now I'm back. <laughs> After 12 hours later, <laughs> it's like that. I was on the toilet that long. But that ain't none of y'all business though. So I'm gonna take this heavy and off. I'm gonna just warn y'all right now, my forehead is on a thousand. It's on a thousand. Don't make fun of me though, okay? Fuck. <laughs> what the fuck? And then trying to make me look stupider. But it's okay. If that's even a word, I don't know. I just say stuff that's pretty out of content. So I'm just gonna take these two braids out. You guys are gonna watch me real quick. Empire. Empire. <laughs> Which I know is really disgusting. But that's why I'm going to wash my hair. My hair is going to get curly. I'm going to put some shampoo, conditioner in it also. I'm going to show you guys that before I even get into it. Because I'm going to do it better than part one. Because it's a part two. I got to do better than the first time, boo. So let me show y'all. Where is the shampoo at? Where's my conditioner? Sorry if you can't hear my brother's yelling. I don't know if he's on online gaming. I don't know whatever you guys call it, but he's yelling immaculately loud. You're just dumb. But I also need to go get my rag because my mom did some freaking laundry yesterday and she said, all the rags are all in the shower. So I have to go get me some more. And I also forgot my brushes. You know, you have to brush your hair while you're in the shower. So yeah, I'm going to do that because I'm talking way too much right now. Let me go. So you guys, I'm going to show you guys what kind of brushes that I use. I use this comb, this wide tooth comb, because when you have kinkly hair, you need something wide to go through that because you know right now it's not going to go through it because it's freaking tangled up into a whole bunch of tangles. But when I wet it, this comes in handy dandy, okay? Yes, it does. And then this is just a detangling hairbrush. You know, you go like this when your hair is wet and it goes right through, slippity slide. You guys will see it just like you guys saw in the first video. But just in case you didn't see the first video, you're going to watch this one definitely. The type of shampoo that I do use, I don't know which one I'm going to use today because I usually use this one, but I think I'm going to try this one, but I don't know. Whichever one looks like it smells better. This is um Whole Blends Garnier, and it's smoothing shampoo, coconut oil, and cocoa butter extracts. This is the one I usually use because it makes my hair smell so good. So I'm just going to stick to this one. Yeah, we're going to do this one. But I'm also going to show you this one, guys. This one is avocado oil and shea butter. It's the same one, Whole Blends from Garnier and everything. Deeply replenishes and restores. See, that sounds really interesting. But I don't feel like using it, so we're not using it. And lastly, the conditioner that I keep inside my hair for about five minutes is this. This is the best, you guys. This makes your hair really easy to comb, makes it really easy to, you know, mm, this is for us. <laughs> but, um, yeah, it's Cocoa Repair. It's from Aunt Jackie's. Now, this costs about, like, $50, but I promise you it's, like, really worth it. Coconut cream, deep conditioning. So this is a deep conditioner. You can never go wrong with a deep conditioning now. You can never go wrong with it. 
So yeah, we're gonna hop in the shower. I'm gonna take this off because you can't go in the shower with clothes on. I mean, you could, but that would be nasty because what are you cleaning? Nothing. <laughs> exactly. So, not doing that. Alrighty, we're gonna hop into this. <laughs> I'm back. <laughs> so now we're gonna turn on the shower. Alright, so what we're gonna do is just open this nice, lovely shower. Okay, and I forgot to get my rag. So I decided to step out of my comfort zone and go get green because there was no other color that I really wanted. They were like pink or white, you know, my usual. And you turn on the water. Last time I did this, I made a big mess, but I had to clean it up. So this time we're not going to let that happen because I'm going to move the carpet because I am not washing anything again. <laughs> then we up in. All right, come on, guys. Hey, hey, say ho. Ho. That's when I'll come back in here and finish my hair. But I'm gonna check on my little sister. She's asleep. Aww. I'm just gonna get something to drink because I'm like really parched. It's so hot in that bathroom, it's not even funny. Yeah. Damn! You guys, look at the weave. It's just sitting there like a pile of chickens. What? I can't wait to wash this out so I can get in the shower and get out. I'm just gonna take a walk. Jesus, it's 2.29. My mom will be getting out work soon. Whew. I'm just walking around. My hair actually doesn't look too bad like this. If you guys look at it from my perspective. Yeah, not too bad. Whew. Let me take a seat. But anyways, guys, I'm going to take you guys through the whole journey of what I do after I get in the shower, too. Like, after I get dressed and I do my hair, I might style my hair. I'm not sure. It looks unstylable right now. If you guys can't see, it looks pretty unstylable right now. But I'm going to try to do something out. Even if it's just plain slick back with my edges done. I don't know, but I'm going to do something. But yeah, my hair got to be detangled first. And that's on period. I'm just waiting for this alarm to go off so that way I could go back and wash this out my hair. But anyways, y'all, I don't know. I've been such a crazy week, you know, for the celebrities <laughs> and me, kind of. With me having to deal with everything, you know, trying to get situated with my uncle's death and everything. From last 4th of July, we just recently had a celebration of him. This 4th of July that passed, I'm still indecisive if I want to do that video and share you guys the whole story. Because it's like so deep and I don't really want to cry on YouTube. <laughs> I really don't. And I know if I tell the story, I'm going to cry. 
And then I got some extra news from my mom, and it's just like, what the fuck is going on? Like, I don't know. But I don't know. I might do it. I might not. I don't know. I'm not sure. Maybe I need a little more time. It is what it is. If I do it, I do it. Yeah, there's a lot of deep stories that I want to share, but I'm not sure if I want to because, you know, maybe I'll wait till next year when I'm 18 and I have all the power so nobody can ever tell me anything. It's a lot. But yeah, you guys are going to get to know me as the years go by more and more. I try to put out good content out there for you guys so you guys can actually want to watch my videos, you know. It's kind of hard. I'm not going to lie. Trying to please you guys, trying to get myself to 1K by the end of this year. You know, I'm trying really hard. And I see progress. I see a lot of progress. But I'm just saying, I want to see a little bit more. You know, everybody wants something that's higher than their standards for themselves. That's totally normal. I noticed that about a lot of people. Everybody wants their self to be higher than they really should be. Like, I could be growing fast right now to some people. But to me, I'm growing a little, like, only a little fast. But I'm doing what I can. So I'm doing good for what I do. Because nobody knows me. I'm still unknown. But people are going to figure you out if you just keep going and don't give up. And that's for anybody up here who wants to start a YouTube channel. Just don't give up. Because it was a couple times I wanted to give up, honestly. And I didn't. So that's why I'm still growing. Because I'm not giving up. And I don't care what anyone has to say. A lot of people had doubts about me and my channel. But I didn't care. You know, I just kept going because I felt like... I have some point of success in this. I just feel it. I don't know why, but I just feel it. It's just there. Like, I feel like I'm going to make it. I'm going to be a star YouTuber one day. Whether anybody believes in me or nobody believes in me, like, I'm going to do it. Patience is key. And practice makes perfect. And I learn as I go, so I'm only getting better. So, F the negativity, because it don't mean nothing to me. I'm about to go check the timer, because I'm pretty sure it's up. But it would have wrong, but oh, it's ringing now. <laughs> All right, guys, we're about to get right back into it. E M M G. All right, y'all, so I'm going to catch y'all when I get out the shower. I'm about to get in the shower, and y'all just going to be waiting for me patiently until I get out of the shower. It'll take, like, 20 minutes, but it'll go fast like lightning. I promise. Watch. Two hours later. See, guys, that didn't take so long. So I put this thing in the back of my hair. That's why I let that eat. But I'm going to try to, like, do a little style or whatever. Uh, I don't really know. But we're going to see. We're going to see. I like the way my hair turned out, but it looks cute, sus. A little bit. It just need a little moisturization, okay? And then we'll be period to the T good. You feel me? And I need some my edges, and I'm not keeping my hair like this, so we need to get it freaking popping. Let me put some clothes on first, though. Okay, y'all, so I'm gonna put some of this in my hair. Let me put y'all on. It's from Softy Signature Thickening. Growth oil is basically what it is. Oh my god. And it's starting to look crazy, so we're just gonna put some oil. Doesn't feel like anything's really coming out. Actually feels pretty good. I didn't have any of this in like months. This should be good for now. I'm just gonna like massage my scalp a little bit. Jesus. Okay, maybe I could keep it like, no, I'm not keeping it like this. I'm bugging. I mean like, it's not bad, but it's just, Hey, baby. Hey. No call when I'm going broke. Oh. Hey. Video. I did a hair video. Oh, right. Say hi. Hey. You're so cute. <laughs> Thank you. That was my lovely boyfriend. I don't know why he's trying to be so nice. It's like, nah, he's always like that. He's just a sweetheart. Hey, uh, we gotta get this hair done. Uh, Jesus Christ, what, is the, what was that? Okay, what was that? So, I'm just gonna do like maybe some two ponytail styles. I don't fucking know. Yeah. 
y'all. So this is the finished product. Um, I usually do my edges with something different, but I tried Gorilla Snot and it did not work for me. Don't use Gorilla Snot on this type of hair that I have because uh, it came out looking dumb and bummy. So I got to fix it, but I'll fix it off camera. But that's all. That's my Watch Day Part 2 video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And share this video with somebody just you think will like it also. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace. What's poppin' cake crew? Uh. What's poppin' cake crew? It's another... Oh.